Hey, what's up everyone? It's Dennis here from Baristi Workout and we're testing a couple of dip bars today then some pushing training um, The reason is that a lot of people don't have parks a lot of people that contact us They ask you know, how can we train if we don't have a park? Um, and especially where can we do dips if we do have something to do pull-ups on but we don't have you know anything to do dip bars on So this might be a solution those are a couple of um, the portable dip bars that you can buy on, on Amazon or any other online store. And um, that's you know three different types and uh, three different price ranges. And I'm just gonna show you really quick the differences and maybe some of that could be useful to you. Okay. Um, this one is from Amazon, it's like 60 euros or something, that's what, like 80 bucks. Um, the good thing is that it's, it's four parts, so you put it, you, you know, you can take it out and it's uh, four really small parts, you can put it into a bag or something. Once you put it together, it's a unit. So um, it doesn't move, you know, like one of these that can actually fall over. Here, um, once you're in the dip position and you press it out, it's really stable and you can do a lot and it, it doesn't really, like you can't, you can't really um, make it fall over. It's really good to grip and um, it's really stable. You can do handstands, you can do dips, you can do anything. You can also do some type of explosive stuff and it will not fall. The only problem I see is that, I don't know if you can see it, here there are like three positions to um, change the width of the bars. And now this is the smallest, the narrowest position. And this is already pretty large. So for me, it's pretty good. But I can see someone who's uh, not as tall as me um, having a problem because this, this the narrowest position might already be a little too large. But all in all, it's a really good um, tool and you can have some fun with that. All right, next one up is the uh, equalizer. A lot of people know it because, you know, it's really, uh, it's been around for a long time and a lot of people train with it. Um, I really like it. The, the tubes, the pipes here are thicker, so it's a little better to grip. The only problem I see, as you can see, the difference from here to here, this is a lot, a lot smaller. So me being a little tall, um, I almost touch with my feet when I do dips. But other than that, it's it's good. It's really stable. It can fall over if you really exaggerate. If you do some crazy stuff, it might fall, uh, which cannot be cannot happen here. But um, for regular dips, for handstand training for LSIT, for anything that is not too explosive. This is a great tool. Um, and this one is, I'll put the links down in the description. I think it's like 90 or 100 euros. Um, next up here is a German product from uh, Klimmzugstangen.de. I'll put the link down if you want to take a look at it. This is a little bit more expensive. Uh, it's like 170 or 180 euros. Uh, but it's a great tool. I've been training with it for a couple of weeks now. It's uh, the tallest, the highest one of all. So for me, that's perfect. I can go all the way down, and I will not touch or anything. And uh, since it's since the bars are high, and the feet here are really large, it's really stable. So um, it's more definitely more stable than the equalizer. So you can do, do some some explosive stuff, and it, it's really hard to to make it fall over. So. Um, all in all, it's just a question of, of price and your height. All of these are great, especially if you look for something you know, to do pushing exercises, to do uh, parallel bar dips. Any of these will work. Any of these will work for handstand training. Um, and you can do a lot of, a lot of crazy core exercises on this too. So it boils down to what you like more. This is definitely the more expensive one, but it's definitely the highest quality one. And it will probably last you longer, but, um, you know, it's a matter of how much you want to spend. If if you need any of these, all of these are really uh, really easy to you know to take and to carry. They're really light. You can carry them to the park. You can use them in your home. Um, so, if you're looking for some dip bars, maybe one of these could be uh, the solution. If you have any question about any of these, uh, just drop us a message or an email, baristiworkout@gmail.com, or comments, and we'll try to figure it out. We use these. Um, on a regular basis so we can do a couple of other videos if you have some more questions about them uh, but they're all really good okay so check them out and keep working hard